Neurosurgeons have long considered tumors in deep areas of the brain inoperable, giving patients very few treatment options and often little hope. Well, now a new tool is allowing doctors better access to those hard to reach sections of the brain using a minimally invasive approach. 53-year-old Bob Benner loves taking an active role in his son's sports. Nice. Should have kept driving. Right now, Bob is sidelined, recovering from a life-threatening condition. Pounding headaches, his son hurt, hit a bump in the car hurt, uh, just headaches all the time. Doctors diagnosed Bob with cancer in his back and another tumor deep in his brain. The idea of brain surgery was frightening. Are you going to be able to talk afterwards, walk, or are you going to lose your sight? A new tool is now giving surgeons options where none had existed before. The brain path allows doctors to reach deep areas in the brain without disturbing critical nerves and tissues. Using computerized mapping of the brain, surgeons make a small opening and insert the tube. The brain is not a smooth surface, so we then go through one of the valleys in the brain. Doctors can see the tumor using cameras in a port. The brain path also allows doctors to remove the lesion. The tumors can be anything from something that could be the size of a pea to something to the size of a golf ball. When doctors remove the tumor and the brain path, the brain tissues move back into place, leaving just a small scar. Oh, nice. Bob Benner's cancer is in remission. Now he's looking forward to cheering his son on next season. Doctors say the brain path can also be used effectively for patients with hemorrhagic or bleeding stroke, which can result in brain damage, paralysis, or even death.